Some great news for the thousands of Koreans who have shown an interest in snapping up a Tesla vehicle. The first Tesla showroom has opened its doors in Korea. Our Shin Semin takes a look at whether the launch will reshape the Korean EV market and what local consumers look for in such green vehicles. The world class electric vehicle maker has hit the Korean market. This is the first of Tesla's two showrooms opening this week at Hanam Shopping Center, located just outside of Seoul. The U.S. carmaker has received immense attention even before the launch of its store, with more than 1,000 Korean customers locking in deals for Tesla's EV cars. The number of test drive requests made by potential customers has also topped all other countries where Tesla has offline stores in operation. The futuristic design and technological competitiveness makes me lean more towards Tesla, and I would want to see what other models they bring in. So far, Tesla only has plans to deliver the Model S 90D luxury vehicle with a driving range of up to 378 kilometers on a single charge, by far the highest among all other electric cars out in Korea. The Tesla interface and technological performance of the built-in software nears that of a smartphone operating system, a reason why Tesla cars are called smartphones on wheels. But all this comes with a hefty price tag, starting at 105,000 U.S. dollars. On top of its stellar features, Tesla's key strength in pure electric car has geared up a keen interest, especially as Korea faces concerns about its air quality. Fuel efficiency is one thing, but with concerns about diesel cars mounting because of the environmental factor, as well as a potential tax hike, I want to check out new high-end EVs. The government, which has identified old diesel cars as a source of increasing fine dust and air pollution, has vowed to replace all diesel buses with natural gas-powered vehicles. It has also warned it will toughen restrictions on diesel-powered vehicles, leading to higher sales of electric cars. The number of EVs sold in Korea more than doubled last year compared to the year before, accounting for 0.4 percent of the country's entire domestic car sales of 1.6 million. And the Environment Ministry expects that ratio will gradually rise. Despite the growing interest in Tesla, as well as EVs in general, there still remains the challenge of installing enough chargers to meet swelling demand from EV drivers. Tesla Korea says it'll build six supercharger stations for its new customers, while the government plans to boost the number of regular charging stations to 20,000 this year. Shin Semin, Arirang News.